We're back with Carrie Sharkey Miller. So Carrie, tell us when you started working in this process. Um, I've been doing it for about two years now, and um, I've been experimenting with doing this process on not only the aluminum, but I also do it on um, wood um, and on uh, other substrates as well. This is an example of a piece that I'm working on currently. The blue is just tape um, to keep the edges clean while I'm working on it. Um, but this is an image that was uh, printed on the same kind of film and then transferred onto um, a birch box. Um, one of the other processes that I'm working with is I print images on vellum and then um, I will back the vellum with gold leaf. And um, this is actually a 23 karat gold leaf. Wow. And um, the image after the leaf is applied to it, I varnish both sides of the uh, vellum and um, it gives a real nice luminescent quality to the image. Yeah. So um, I've been experimenting with using the same image several times. Um, this is actually a photograph that was taken of the aluminum piece that I have up there. And um, what I do when- Where was this taken, Carrie? <laughs> <laughs> the bird was taken right here at Southampton Art Center this summer when uh, Photo Arc was here and we had wild wildlife <laughs> come in and bring their birds in. And it was really a wonderful opportunity to uh, photograph them. So, so in uh, the wild of Southampton the Art Center's studio. That's right, that's <laughs> right. Really wild little studio that we got here. Uh, so yeah, I photographed him here. And then the um, all the patterning you see on here is actually the um, oxidation that takes place. And you can see where it's hand polished, the lines in there. So the image of the bird is um, the only part of the photograph. Um, but when I work with these things, I'll actually photograph the aluminum panel and uh, bring it into Photoshop and look at it with my images. So um, I line up, you know, how I uh, would like the image to be on the aluminum. And then I drop the aluminum out of the picture, just print the, um, the bird in this case. And then that's what's on the film and that's what gets transferred to the aluminum. And then, uh, but I do still have that image um, where the aluminum is behind it. And I've taken that image, printed it on the vellum, and then I'm, you know, did this, this is the one that I did with gold leaf on the back. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's really interesting for me to uh, experiment a little bit by using the same images and see how they translate differently um, with the different mediums that I'm doing. Um, another um, group that I'm gonna be working on during takeover is Behind You. And it's the color photographs that I have on the wall here. And these um, are kind of a maquette of images that I'm gonna be doing on uh, wood. So this triptych here will be three individual wood panels um, and the image is transferred directly to the wood. And the same thing with the image above, it will be a separate image on wood. Um, these are my straight photographs, but um, like I said, I like to take the same image and play with it in different mediums. Um, with my images, I um, do limit the uh, number of times I'll use an image. Um, I've, since I started this process, I came up with um, the idea of doing a set number of images um, in each medium. So for instance, on the aluminum ones, I'll do a series of, I won't do any more than eight. Um, each one will be unique because the background will be different. And that image itself, even though I used it in the gold, um, a total of 36 images, um, total of that image. And then I won't use that image again. So um, there, it's a variable edition. Each one is unique. So I'll try it in different mediums, but I limit the number of times that I'll use any particular image to 36. So uh -huh. um, well, we'll take a, a peek at your, your space now. And uh, where can people find your work outside of Southampton Arts Center? Do you have a website? I do have a website. It's ksharkeymiller.com. Um, I actually do most of my architectural work on there, but um, I will be updating it uh, very soon to have um, uh, examples of this work on it as well. So if you need to have architectural photographs taken, you can call Carrie for that as well. <laughs> Thank you, Amy.
And just a reminder that all of these works, as well as everybody else's and Takeover, are available for purchase. Just email us at info at southhamptoncenter.org for more information and to inquire about purchasing something. Thank you, Carrie. Thank, Thank you for sharing Danny. your work with us. Thank, for you. Thank you for all the support you give us. It's amazing. It's our pleasure. You guys are the best. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>